In this video, we will be showing three alternative supports that you can use for your models. For this tutorial, I'm going to import uh, a piece with some arches that uh, we would like to support. Um, we will also turn on the uh, live support preview that will aid us a bit uh, during supporting. We'll first talk about the internal supports. An uh, internal support is defined as a support with one top point and multiple uh, feet. So we select uh, the internal support tool and you notice there's a, a hint of what to do next on the bottom right. The highest point is our top point. Um, so this is the one that, that we'll uh, create first. There is a top point. Um, and then <coughs> we have to create some, uh, some feet. And you can do this by just clicking after each other. And when you're done, you press enter. And the support is set. Um, now you probably would like to uh, increase the st strength a bit here in the middle. So I'm going to increase the diameter here, just to make it a bit stronger. The second support we're going to be talking about is the internal tree support, which is over here on the top. Um, again, there's a hint of what to do next on the bottom right. The lowest point here is the, the foot point. I'm going to turn on the live preview again. And, uh, at the bottom point and then add some top points. And press enter when you're done. And we have a uh, internal tree support. You might want to increase the thickness in the middle and at the bottom to strengthen it. And we're done. The last type of support we're going to talk about is the tree support with a normal foot. So you can add this in a similar uh, manner. Only here you don't have a bottom point. So we just have some top points. Press enter when we're done. And we have a normal tree support. Now you might want to move these points a bit outward of your model. 